Hey YouTube, remember her this scent. is Angel 5 coming to you with the another scary game, Serena. Uh, Serena. Serena. Just started. So sometimes when I make a great effort, I can remember her secrets. The furniture came with the cabin. Considering how off the beaten path, Serena. Why, can I see why can't I see you more clearly? Why can't I even... But this was taken on that crisp winter night at our mutual friend's hunting lodge. We came back indoors, laughing, giddy as teenagers. <laughs> so, uh, Serena sure enjoyed game, spice but... in our life. I preferred it more bland. We were so different on some points. Sometimes she would brush her leg against mine under the table when we were eating. A curious, sensual thrill. The table is worn but sturdy, just like our relationship was, hmm. or is. I just don't, just don't know anymore. Oh, so I get a point and click. Sharing meals with a good red wine was one of the great pleasures in our relationship, especially in the intimacy of this cabin. So much wisdom and happiness in this bookcase. The smell of old. I loved it when we took down one of my favorites and curled up on the bed to read together as the wind howled outside on cold winter nights. Most of the books are mine, but all of hers are still here too. A lot of rarities and special editions here. A lot of rarities and special editions here. So many afternoons spent in this armchair. Oh, this is creepy. That is really creepy. This one wobbles. I always meant to do something about that, but somehow never got around yeah, to it. Window. This window never got much attention. Then again, the view isn't nearly as spectacular. Priorities, right? Something draws me. To we use this trunk to store trinkets and papers, but I can't help thinking there's something of importance inside. So open it. It's too painful. I want to, but not yet. You gotta find the key, I guess. Because just say like that. But hey, I don't have the key, Dumbledore. Quite a large armoire for our admittedly Spartan needs. She uses most of it. Ooh. She adored all things of nature. I remember her long walks out in the wood. She is fairly religious, not me. I'm the cold and cynical bastard. But I don't remember that ever being an issue between us. The clock is a trophy from our flea market adventures. Hmm. Chalk this particular purchase up to every cabin needs one. This is really cool. Something in here interesting. Some the magazines. Our refuge from the world. Huh. Oh, right here. A place of warmth and passion. Are, um, vanity officers, so. They prevent my blood pressure from skyrocketing. Doctor's orders. I'm certainly. generally not fond of taking medication. I find it hard. Hers. I used it too when shaving. Oh, These keys. keys are for the cabin and the car. Okay, let's take it. If the keys are. I should probably stay here in case she doesn't. Did she even have her own spare? Can we just take it? We also have a key for the outhouse. But can't be bothered to keep it anywhere other. There's a strand of blonde hair in the comb. Yes. Blonde hair like sun rays. I'm remembering. Okay, that's a watch. That's some money, it's a wallet. I can't get Dearest, how do I say any of this? I like your way with words, but if I don't write this, I don't know what I'll do. My life feels so unreal now, dreamlike, but wonderfully so. Where Let me try, even if clumsily. The hours I spent with you when we last met are precious to me. I was so lost such a short time ago. 
Everything seemed drained of color and feeling. I think we were meant to find each other, to bring meaning to our lives again, make sense of the confusion shrouding both of us. When we stepped into the crystal silence of the snowy woods, away from the chatter of the guests, all nature seemed expectant, as if holding its There's breath, witnessing a rare moment of something infinitely better than what life in the ordinary run of things has to offer. Do you remember how the light, you remember how the light crust of the snow glittered in the reflected light of the country house? How the copse of trees in which we walked was haloed with a magical aura? I felt the chill of the night air, and you opened your coat and enfolded me in your arms, and we hugged tight, sharing the warmth, sharing the only thing any of us have to share on this earth when you think about it. And then you toppled us on the snow, you devil. We laughed and rolled around, my head already spinning from the wine and crisp pure night air and the stillness all around. We lay back and I guess when I realized what I was seeing. The luminous starscape, like a vast velvet cloth sprinkled with powdered sugar, like it can only be seen in the countryside. I had tears in my eyes when I turned to you and we kissed, and it felt like the only moment in all of time, or outside time, and ours was the only spark that could ignite the universe. Why did you sound like she's a ghost? Is she dead? You gave me these moments. You complete me in ways I never knew to dream of. I guess Let me be the one who makes sense of the confusion whenever you feel lost again. We can make our own world against the rest of the world if need be. Together we can silence all the demons, heal all the wounds. I love you. In eternity yours, Serena. Hmm. I still can't understand. Even the features of her face feel hazy and distant, like remnants of a broken dream. Why can't I grab those keys? Commune evidence. I've always told Serena that she doesn't need to wear perfume. Her presence is magical enough already. Come, love, with peace in your heart, said Niav of the ice blue eyes. Hmm. Blue eyes. We found this trunk at a flea market. We used to love rummaging yeah, around those in our what what early years. Oh, oh, why is this kid covered? Creepy. Yeah. No, I don't want to leave right now. I, I better stay in in case Serena comes back. Serena's not gonna come down, you weirdo. You go find her. Oh, what's over there? Oh, where am I? I'm going to look it up. Can I open these? No. That's weird. That's weird. This used to be her favorite spot. She used to sit here, put her legs on the table, lean back, and just give me one of her smiles. Those She made this with her own hands. She was really good. There's something up there? This started to creep me out. Let me look out the window, the window. It's a beautiful day, though there's an unnatural calm surrounding the area. This is getting weirder and weirder for me. I've oh, always oh, loved the hazy afternoon shades of this place. Look what I made, hun. In case we ever need to sweep something under the carpet. Nothing here. Nope. Try this again. We all have our skeleton. I'm not sure why, but I don't feel like opening it. The sole thought of it drains what little energy I have left in me. Oh my god, you're ridiculous. Sometimes we joked we needed to be so far. For some reason, light bulbs wouldn't last long in this lamp. I never looked into it. See the pattern of yellow squares? It's from this rug I remembered from my nursery. I must have been like three or four, but it always stuck with me. True friends stand by each other through any adversary. Uh huh. Will you uh, open that shit up real quick? Big enough for a lifetime. We hated guns, so we never had any, even out here. But this would have been a good place to keep one, since it can be locked. Our dining table. 
quite, I could tell, plenty of stories about this. Once, we dragged these chairs out to the lake and scrubbed off all the dust and grime of years. That was a long time ago. That was getting weirder, weirder. Why can't I do much? Oh shit, look, I can remember her now. It was truly like an enchanted time, like we were in a magic circle where no sorrow or pain could touch us. Oh, I remember her now. Blue eyes, blonde hair. My love. Okay. Oh shit. Fuck. Okay. How long has it been, I wonder? I can't tell. We seemed to take fewer and fewer walks as the years went by. Everything around here is... I know it's my general state of mind, but I feel even more depressed near this home now. Really Guess I can't shake off the memory of my sweet Serena trying on her very... Is there anything worse than beautiful memories turning to dust? Why? I might just as well stay here. I'm not gonna lie, my, my heart's pounding a little harder. The music is really playing its own. Could you take this out and beat it, love? It's getting a bit dusty. I should leave the keys here until she comes back. Because I know she will. So she might not come back and let's go look for you, crazy. Where are you going? She always reminded me to take these. I never been so immature about these. Even resorted to the old pill on I never noticed it before, but there's a tiny crack in it. I still remember when this thing smelled of fresh paint. Why is she crying? The love letter. The monies. Two quarters. The mayor gave me. More clothes. Ticking. It never stops. No. I've wasted so much time in my life. Did I ever take a break to show her how much I truly cared? The clock has always it. been rather autonomous. No matter how many times we've wound it up, it keeps going out of sync. Do you remember how the light crust of the snow glittered in the reflected light of the country house? As always, I automatically went to the window side, and she took the one by- Everybody thinks that living out in the middle of a dark, dense forest is so romantic. Nothing but you scary. and nature. Serena and I thought so too, once. It was scary That now. is, until the loneliness kicked in. Yeah, I'm sick of each other, huh? That's funny. I don't recall seeing this plant before. Huh. Yeah, Not that it matters. She probably found this rare spec. Is it possible there were times I was dismissive of her beliefs without even realizing it? I don't think so, effect. but memory can be so deceptive. It's just a book. Stupid, feeble-minded woman with her silly, menial things. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Kids are still there. The ghost is still there. Books are still there. I tried to be charitable with her, but what did it get me? Sit down. We need to talk. What? When did it go so wrong? This was supposed to be a. We weren't supposed to fight here. You just don't get it, do you? You Ooh. never do. Ooh. 
Oh, now she's mad. Look at her, she's mad at me. She's not even happy. She's anymore. angry now. Part of me realizes I should be more shocked by this, but for some reason, I just feel numb. Beyond it. She was lying to me and manipulating me all the Yes, go ahead and empty the whole salt shaker on your meal. I hope you choke. What? What are we trying? Truth is, I could have used this spice to get some of her abominations down my throat. What? Dude, you were loving her like a minute ago. Open the shit up. Oh, finally. The jewelry box. What is it doing here? I sit here on the train, taking me to my final farewell to the ones who brought me to this world. I see the smiling couples on their way to new adventures and Ooh, think it used to be us. We had joy and laughter and friends once, but a memory is not the thing itself. You're very good at letting things you don't want to face slip off you. You continue as if nothing has changed, lost in your own lifeless world. Words and dreams may be enough for you. You know what? You'll get a chance to test that soon. I question how I once saw things. How much of what I thought we had were my own feelings, and how much of your manipulation. Because you are so very good with words, aren't you? You knew how to use them when we so met, and for the longest like... time, I went along with the romantic whirl you conjured up around our shabby, isolated existence. Oh, it took me long enough to see it for what it was. And there were these moments that you swept me off on foolish flights of fancy, when I threw myself into your fantasies. You wove your spell, plying me with your magic and with wine in equal measure, and I was taken in like the lost little girl I was. Wow. Do you realize all the pain you've caused me? They say if you have to ask whether someone loves you, you already know the answer. Protestations to the contrary can no more convince me any more than I can make my own mother or father draw breath again. Your aloofness tells a different story. Wow. She really does I like no him. longer know what you're thinking. With my parents gone and with your refusal to even accompany me in my time of need, something broke. Or maybe it happened long ago, but I never saw it so clearly before, even after everything. I don't make you feel comfortable? Really? really? That's all you have to say? <clears throat> I won't waste any more life waiting for things that'll never come. Of course, She's that's really what you expect now. me to do. Play the good wife so no one will laugh at you for being the failure you are to shield you from the truth of your existence. Lost in your books and vapid verse, blithely drifting into this the mists of time, as if not did. even a footnote, when you could be How raking it if you'd wrong? only used your words for anything other than personal <coughs> indulgence. <coughs> you talked and talked about your path, the winter blueness of my eyes, all that nonsense. And the years rolled by, the seasons came and went, on and on. You pursuing your dreams that will never be. Lost wow. in your damned words, looking for clues you'll never find. I'm sure you're doing it even now with your rotting books. You took the best years of my life and gave only empty words in return. We've gone as far as we can, and something's got to give. Wow. It's just a bunch of schmaltzy junk. A shrine to naivety. I don't see anything else of... I should just destroy this useless junk. But not even the venom inside me gives me strength. This is insane how angry he got. All of this... these... <laughs> pathetic souvenirs from our relationship. They're all lies. Um. Weird. Pretty sure you put the jewelry box on the, on the thingy. Guess I could have thanked that heartless slut at least once cool. whenever she covered up her body. Wow. Where are you going? Oh, that's rich. Just run away. I just needed to blow off steam to be somewhere else just for a while but I, I can't even remember what we argued about no this isn't like me I must calm down if anyone is to be blamed that's me I tried to flush these a long time ago but someone noticed as if she cared about my impotent life <sighs> she once told me how I supposedly used words to fool her somehow but what did she think this stuff was natural Where do you put the jewelry box? The jewelry box is over. Oh, maybe the closet. Let me look at the clock one more time. That incessant noise! I should smash this useless antique to pieces right now! What's there? Hmm. I should wait. It can't keep the time for five minutes straight. All the real color faded from it long ago. I should tear all her filthy, disease-ridden clothes apart and burn everything she wore, just to lure me in. He's so angry. Where 
What is it? Is there an inventory box? Inventory? Nope. It was she who didn't deserve me. I wouldn't waste my intellect on this. What good will reading a fairy tale do me? Really? She slams it. The stains on this bed suddenly make me mad. <coughs> Angry, even. I go see the door. A part of me still thinks you'll forgive me and come back. <coughs> but I've lost all hope now. This armchair. This is where we had that talk. That damn... I've been trying so hard, but we lost something along the way. I couldn't care less about this damn thing. I feel like throwing this chair through the window. But that would just make me even angrier. I'm the one who should have been scowling. She played me like She's a harp angry, and made me look like a complete idiot! Why torture myself trying to run? Too upset to even think straight. She never had any sense for balancing a meal. It was either spicy hot or cringeworthy bland. Okay. I was her wedding ring or mine. But what is it doing here? Oh, please, no. I remember how happy these made her. <coughs> she smiled. That wonderful that smile. Wonderful smile. I hate her so much. What? Dude, you just like me. You loved her. How do you hate something? Oh my god. Okay, good. I thought it was like a dead body in here. <laughs> oh my god, there is a dead body. We had a plan. I took measures to ensure nothing like this would happen. My God, what is this? Oh my God, it can't. It isn't. Don't worry, it's all covered. We spent much time here. What's talking? How did it happen? I can't remember. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. What's the mumbling? You can hardly hear the mumbling. It's already rotten beyond recognition. How much time has passed? Oh my god, that shit scared me for a little bit. Everybody has those skeletons? Please, let me wake up. Let it be a dream. Those noises, are they coming for me? I deserve it, but... I want to see who it is first. Dead. Worm eaten wood. Yeah, what is that? Oh shit! My oh. face. What's happened to my face? Is this my punishment? Oh my god, why am I skeleton? It's like looking into a mirror. I took her life. I am a demon. A destroyer. Oh my god, what's Impure. Just words. This is oh, sure. not life. Do you realize how stupid this was? We had a plan. I took measures to ensure nothing like this would happen. But no, you couldn't help your dad. They killed self. me. We can't risk moving it now. The bulldozers are coming any minute. What? Fire will do it. Do you think they will buy it after all this time? It's been months since you. Don't worry. It's all covered. He spent much time here. Fine. Give me the kerosene. What? Oh, shit. You forgot your... Fuck. It was so stupid to leave it. Why did you do that? Can you calm down? I couldn't bear to wear it any longer. It's in a safe place. We'll take it from the ashes. No. Oh no! No! Not like this! Let me go! Please! Let me go! No! Holy cow! <laughs> wow.
What a twist. So she killed me with some other dude. Wow. And she left her ring and she didn't care. And the bulldozer's coming. Oh, wow. Serena, huh? <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you guys uh, can uh, like more of these. Please subscribe for more. <laughs> I can't even talk. I'm sorry, guys. Have a good one.